Princess Theatre in Melbourne is the home of a third well-loved ghost called Fred. It's the apparition of a noted opera singer, Frederick Baker, who died in the theatre under the most bizarre circumstances imaginable. On March the 3rd, 1888, Frederick was playing the demonic role of Mephistopheles in a production of Faust. In the final scene of the opera, Mephistopheles returns to Hades with Faust, and Fred, in crimson costume, descended to hell amid theatrical smoke and flames through the stage trapdoor. A platform operated by ropes and pulleys carried Fred below, but he suffered a heart attack on the way down and died without speaking another word. It seems Fred couldn't accept missing out on the final bow, because from the moment he died, strange events were recorded at the Princess Theatre. His ghost has become a theatrical legend. The Phantom is known to generations of theatre folk as Federici, a glowing human shape whose appearance spells good luck for any forthcoming production. And Federici has appeared to scores of people over the past century. As a matter of fact, it was right here. I was sitting where I am standing now, and my back was towards the house, and Malcolm Phillips, who was directing the play, unfortunately Malcolm's now dead, but he was looking out into the theatre and he said, there he is, the poor old bastard, and I said, who? And he said, Fred, Fred, he's out there in the circle. So I really had to build myself up to it. It wasn't not my favourite moment at that moment of time. And I turned round, and there he was, up there in the circle. And the theatre had gone cold. And I became conscious of the smell like old lavender. Um, you know that type of smell if you go into an elderly lady's home and you get open linen drawers and you get that, that strange lavender type smell. But what we saw was a shape of white light like that with a diffused grey light around it. All I can say is that's what happened to me right here on this stage and whatever it was was up there. We've just seen two non-threatening but very different ghosts. Frederici at the Princess Theatre seems to linger on for no apparent purpose. Fisher's ghost suggests two possibilities. The first is that his spirit survived death and came back to give information about the murder. The second possibility is that his observer gained telepathic information from the murderer's mind and dramatised this up into a projected apparition. But our next ghost is quite different. In fact, it may not be a ghost at all. It's a kind of force which brings out the violence in people. And it exists in Clarkfield Hotel, which has the reputation of being the most haunted building in Australia. <laughs> 